Kate Middleton did little to help Harry and William make amends. She was loyal to her husband. Staying out of it, Kate Middleton did little to help brother-in-law Prince Harry and husband Prince William make amends amid their family feud. According to an excerpt obtained by In Touch from the highly anticipated new biographical book, Finding Freedom, Harry and Meghan and the Making of a Modern Family. The Duchess of Cambridge, 38, was fiercely loyal to her spouse, 38, and didn't appear to be interested in bridging the divide between the brothers. Authors Armin Scobie and Caroline Durant write in their memoir set to be re released on Tuesday, August the 11th. Harry, 35, was allegedly met with skepticism from senior royals when wife Meghan Markle came into his life. One senior royal referred to the pharmacist star as Harry's showgirl and another apparently said, she comes with a lot of baggage. Prince Charles's youngest son was aware of the talk about his bride-to-be, a close friend claims in the book, and it made him re-evaluate his inner circle. Harry is extremely protective of Meghan, the Paul alleged. He understands that a lot of people are against them. He would do everything he can to keep her safe and away from getting hurt, even if that means distancing himself from those people. At this point, Harry started distancing himself from his brother, William, and spent less time with Prince Louis than the other kids because of the growing tension between him and his sibling, one except Ritz. The distance between the distance came from both directions. Harry spent less time going over to see the children, but the invites from William and Kate were the first to dry up. The biggest cause of the rift between the brothers was allegedly when William told Harry not to rush into it after falling in love with Meghan. Journalist Carol Malone said in the UK documentary William and Harry, Princess at War. Harry ultimately wed Meghan, 39, on May the 19th, 2018, in St. George's Chapel at Windsor Castle. They went on to welcome their first child, Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor, in May 2019. In January, the Lovebirds announced they would be stepping back from their royal duties in hopes of becoming financially independent. Harry and Meghan now reside in Los Angeles with their son, and they appeared to be pleased with their lifestyle change. William and Kate respect Harry and Meghan's right to make that big decision, but they don't approve of the ways he's gone about it, a source previously told in touch. The Cambridges believe it's down to the circuses to make an effort with the British people and spend more time in Harry's home country.